what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of crashing freezing or lagging issue in modern warfare so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know let you guys know that, that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys who would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step in order to fix the, every kind of crashing, freezing or lagging issue is gonna be to open up your task manager by simply navigating down to your taskbar, right clicking it and opening up your task manager. What I want you to do next is gonna really be simple. Just navigate to the top left corner and ensure that you're sticking around processes. The next step is gonna sound a little bit weird, but trust me guys, just do it and it will help you a lot. And I'm also gonna explain it. So what I want you to do is gonna be really simple. Just right click and enter every single task, um, which has obviously nothing to do with Windows. Why you wanna do that? Simply for two reasons. So first of all, too many applications, programs, games, background processes running at the same time, especially in low end PCs, could cause uh, crashing, freezing or lagging because your PC can't handle that anymore. And the second reason like it was for me, it is that some applications or background processes, don't ask me why, are gonna third party your game, cause it to crash or to freeze or to lag. And by simply ending every single task, you're avoiding this kind of issue. So just do that. And once you're finished, you should be able to end the task manager again. The next step is gonna be to search an empty spot right onto your monitor or your desktop. So just simply right click and click onto display settings. What I want you to do next is going to be that you ensure that you're sticking around display and identify which your main which your main monitor is. Obviously, this just applies if you have more than one monitor. So once you found it, you should be able to scroll down to scale and layout. But I want you to stick around, change the size of text apps and other items, and change it to 100% as recommended. And the display resolution should be the same as in games. So for example, if you have an in-game like 1720 by 1070, you should also apply this to your display resolution. Once you've, found, uh, once you've finished, you should be able to end this task again. And the next step is going to be to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, opening up your setting, navigating to update and security, and stick around Windows Update. And I know, guys, it's going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update will help you a lot with like 99% of your current uh, your, of your technical issues you're currently having with your PC. And uh, also downloading the latest version of Windows will help you a lot with that, and also with crashing, freezing, and lagging. Of course, so download it, provide the best possible performance for your PC. And once you're finished, you should be able to end this task. Next step is gonna to be to do the same thing for your graphics card. So download the latest version of that and uh, provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. That's it for the video, guys. I hope I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. I'm gonna really be thankful for that. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.